this is skyball. But I've done that, I wouldn't attach to anybody. I had to reach out and grab the wing and then let go of the wing. That was back in. This is skydiving. Yeah. No nothing. Yeah. You did skydiving. Yeah, I did. Four times. No, it was the first time you stepped, full step. That's crazy. Yeah. It's fun. It's not crazy. Anyway, here's Chris, here's your notes. If, uh, here's Chris's notes right here. I thought you said you were going to say to be wrong. Oh. Here's your notes. Format. Format. What's up, man? What's up? Chicken butt. I'm just happy right now that I see you did a little setup. You got life hacks, you got mics. This is good. This is good. This, oh, <clears throat> can you hear me now? There you go. Hello? Can you hear me now? Good morning, folks. It's the Subaru Steve Anthony V Show. It's coffee time. Good for your mind. This one is. And we are here at RK Subaru live on Facebook. That's Anthony V. I'm Subaru Steve. Oh. Look, it's Friday. June 25th, I'm talking like this because I don't know if there's people in the waiting lounge behind me right now. But it is Friday, June 25th, 2021. They might. They might. And we are here right now. What am I holding the mic for today? You know? Well, it's a wireless mic, so it doesn't work. Oh, it's wireless. I don't need this. To dream don't do the impossible dream. To find the impossible Possible dime. You ever found the impossible dime? It's 10 cents, yes, but still, the dime that's impossible is the dime to go find. What was that? What? That singer. Who? What? That was, that was, that was, that was, that was dope. That was terrible. That was dope. Hey, listen, uh, you, you know what? I got an oh my gosh fact. Do you? I do. I do. You want to order this? Ooh, I you, it's something you cannot I do. I found it. I found it. I found a little bit of music. Just a little bit. Okay. Better late than never. I like it. Yeah. What's that? It's oh, here we go. Jesus. Oh, hey, hey, hey. Keep checking. You have to think of 25th. Good morning, Lori Johnson. Oh, Friday? The 25th. It's a Monday to me. No, it's a Friday. No, it's a Monday. It's mm -hmm. definitely a Friday. We work tomorrow. It's a Monday to me. I'll be here Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, the next five days. My week is just starting, full of energy. You folks are going to have a great weekend, no matter where you go or what you do. We are too. You know, you cannot say the letters B or M without your lips touching. Try it. Don't try it, you can't do it in your mind. You gotta try it. You gotta try to say the letter B or M without your lips touching. Mm. Huh? That's like you're doing the dolphin. E. You cannot say B or M without your lips hey, touching. Good. Go ahead. You can put a toe between your No, 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 try it. The what? B. Well, let's see the no. <laughs> That's the oh my gosh fact. I don't know what that was for. Uh, Oh, wait, Lori, we're glad you're here right now. You know, we're going to have to do a lot of these, what I would call, I don't know what I would call them. I, got, well, I don't know. You act like, you act like you got a lot on your mind, and, and then you go with it on your mind, and then you, 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 know what you I got stumble about it. You know what I got on my mind right now? What? A year ago, I was talking about some pretty incredible, something really incredibly amazing. You know what I'm talking about? No, we don't. You do. It no, was really no. incredible. It was a year ago. These no. are some incredible people. They're amazing, as a matter of fact. Uh, it seems like just a year ago. I was talking about Todd Smith. Todd? I mean, these people aren't even here because I didn't tag them. But uh, Todd Smith, Scott Thompson, Joe Velasco, Tim Wilcox, Omar Cash Money, the man himself, and Gracie Branch, also bring birthdays today. Omar and Gracie and I, all three worked back in the day down at Charles Parker Toyota. you believe that? It's a true story. It could it be a false story? It's a true story. Did you get all the birthdays out? I think I did. They're not watching, so I just... 
try them out. I'll tag them later, and then they'll watch and go, what the heck was this all about? You want to tell them in case they're tuning in and actually watching the rewind? I don't know what you're talking about. What are you talking about? I just want to know what he's talking about. Anybody know what he's talking about? Lori, do you know what he's talking about? Why is it like, Lori, you're here, but you're not here? You're here, you're not here. Lori's like the flash. Here, here, here. That was really slow. That was slow. I had to slow it down so that you could see it. No. Go ahead, try to say B or M without it. I tried it. Without, you can't do it. Actually, I can. I figured out a way to do this. Because when I read it, you know me, I like to push the envelopes of every day. What envelope are you pushing? <clears throat> Here's how to say B or M without your lips touching. B or M. I substituted my finger. For so well, now my lips gonna, didn't touch. That's how you gonna talk from now on? Hold on, my name is Bob. Imagine if you had no top lip. Bob. <laughs> Try to say Bob without using your top lip. Oh, man. I don't know. You got a lot going on I do, man. Are there any national days today? Because I really didn't need to take a good look yeah, at anything. National Strawberry Parfait Day, man. What is a parfait? It's like a, uh, it's like a mini dessert. I'm envisioning a mini dessert. So you know like the strawberry yesterday? But you would have a little bit of, oh, don't get, oh. you, you would have a little bit of uh, the that straw. jam, if you want to call it. But he talked about the strawberries yesterday. And then I talked about you it have last some night whipped cream to my face. Ooh. And you would have who Some likes type whipped cream? Who, do you love whipped cream? Who cake, likes whipped cream like on them? You like whipped cream? On what? On, on yourself. No. I've seen people do whipped cream faces like we could, Chris. I mean, no, but we, yesterday. Um, I don't know what you're talking about right now. National, a year ago, I told you this. Bro, you're messed up. Pastor man. Leon Dunning, right down here at Salt Church. Mm -hmm. Amazing man. Today is his birthday, too. Well, happy birthday to him. Pastor Leon, happy birthday to you. And it's, it's, it's not his birthday. No, 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 it's not his birthday. It's his national day. I'm sorry, I got that wrong. It's National Leon Day. So all of you who um, know Pastor Leon, go wish him a happy national day. Any other any other uh, kind of days there? Catfish day? Yeah, national catfish. What kind of catfish day? This is like a catfish. You go find a catfish? Or is it a catfish like a fake person? Yeah, yeah. catfish day. I didn't even know that existed until I saw a TV show about that. You know? And here's my favorite, and I wish I'd have realized it before I came to work this morning, because I would have taken advantage of it. It is National Take Your Dog to Work Day. Yes, so if you're still home and you have a dog, and you're, I would have if I'd have known this before I came. I would have brought her in on a leash. What are you going to do? Tell me to take her home? Okay. Yeah. yeah, I should have. If you So if you haven't gone to work yet, grab your dog, put the leash on the dog, go into work with your dog, and when they look at you like, what are you doing? Just say, Anthony V and Subaru Steve said it's national take your dog to work. Don't bring me up. It's a true thing. Go look. Don't go it's on the notes. So you're missing her. Nice setup, by the way, man. I like what? the way I like the way you have all this just arranged. Yeah. Swipe left. They're gone. I can see them up there. Definitely need something stronger in my Coffee, mm. How strong? How strong? Might have something for you. It's in the car. Speaking of having something, you have something super? No, no, I don't have anything super, but I do have a super. You know what's so nice about my super right now and everybody else's car? This is a crazy thing. Everybody else's car right now, not including mine, but probably yours as well. It's worth more than it's ever been worth. Ever. Not ever, but ever. I see most people's cars appraised five months ago, appraised now, for probably three grand more than what it, what it was then. And they have more miles on it, more damage. <laughs> and you're like, well, how is this even possible? There's no cars. So we need your help. So if you're looking to sell your car, your car. Even if you're not buying a car, come by and visit us. We would gladly give you a free appraisal and then see if we could put you uh, off by your car. And maybe put you in a new car. So not something super, but something well, no. vehicle. Maybe it helps you get into a Subaru. Can I tell you what? My car, I have a new car and I'm thinking about selling it to selling it because I can get more money for it right now. It was a trade-in. To another party? You know what? 
doesn't matter who I sell it to, I can sell it for more right now than I owe on it. And it's a brand new, it's a 2020. I could probably sell mine for what, what I paid for. I'm probably gonna sell mine just because the market is that way right now. That's how much of a big deal this is that we're talking about. And let us help you, we know what's going on right now. So call us with questions. You don't have to buy from us to ask us questions. We love answering questions, don't you? You love answering questions? Oh, uh, Subaru. See, I knew you were gonna give me uh, a yes Subaru's, or no. I welcome any question of Subaru. I have customers all the time. I have some questions for you. I said, I promise you I have some answers as well. She says it with a smile. Shoot. Let's go. What if it's something not super? What if it's something about coaching or they need some help and guidance or wisdom or a second opinion on We're, we're talking about customers. Yeah, absolutely. If a customer customers are down, fans. If a customer goes down that route, they most likely would have to know some of my background or we must have had a conversation for them to even bring that up. Now let's talk about, forget the customers for a second, let's talk about Anthony B, your only no, fans. I, I don't have only fans. You don't have fans? I don't know what only fans is. Really. I will say one thing, it was kind of curious how only fans was on my desktop one day. What? Yeah, like... What are like, we talking about here? Only fans, man. Were you on there? No. Am I on there? Do we have fans? Dude, why would this even pop up? Why would it see the pop-up? Uh-oh. You know what I'm saying? Live. It Coming soon. Only, look at this. Only fan hat. Investigative reporting. Anthony B. Subaru Steve. Look at this. Look at this. Only murders in the building. Only what? Now that's scary. Hold the press. Only fans login. Only fan news. Like, who? What is going on? It just lets me know. Somebody's been over here. Yeah. Yeah. Shoot, I had to super glue my USB ports to my own personal jack because people keep moving stuff around and causing a disarray. It happens. So I actually super glued, I go get them, but they're glued. So can you use your cable? No, sorry. I've had them disappeared, broken, stolen. Ooh. Now I gotta take the whole power cord this time. Are you taking cords? No cords? No, my cords are oh, you got a message? super glued. You know what? There's no message there, but I have a message. I'm going to let Lori pick the message this morning, Lori. Lori, put a word up. Put something up, Lori. No, she said strong already, but I'm going to give her a, a chance to, to just, like, maybe she can, wants me to talk about something different. Come on, Lori. If you're there, throw a word up. Give me, like, a 10-second countdown, and then I'm just going to do a message on the word strong. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 2, 2. One. Okay, I'm going to talk about the word strong. Let's talk about strong for a minute. Uh, health. Thank you, Lori, just in time. Strong health. I'm going to put those two together. Let's see how this works. So, strong and health. If you want to be strong, you got to be healthy. Is that true? If you want to be strong, you got to be healthy? If you want to be... No, okay. not necessarily. Okay, if you want to be healthy, do you have to be strong? No, necessarily. What happens when you put them both together? Strong and healthy. Okay. What happens? I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? You're, you're healthy. You're strong. You're just strong and healthy. Just strong and healthy. Did you hear that? Now here's where the message is going. I like that. To people who are strong and healthy, to people who are wealthy, to people who are stealthy, to them it's normal. It's not unusual. To them it's the, it's just normal. You're just strong and healthy. But if you're not and you want to be, You've got to get there. And being strong will help you get there. Being healthy will help you get there. But use them to make them both work for you. Be strong and healthy. It's a challenge. I'm feeling sores and, and not sores, aches and pains that I've never felt before at my age. If I was stronger and healthier, I might have put that off another five years. Now I'm wondering what can I do now to reverse that process? 63, 64 years old, I'm not winding down. No, I'm ready to wind up again. You know what I'm saying? Why not? Yeah, man, be strong and healthy in everything you do. We can, we can tell ourselves, you know what, I'm just me. This is just what I am. I'm just, I'm not, in your case, it's a great thing. A lot of us would like to say, I'm, I'm just strong and healthy. I'm healthy. I can say that. I am healthy. I can't say strong. I'm not strong as I used to be. I can be stronger than I am. So I'm not going to just settle for, yeah, I'm just strong and healthy. I'm going to find that next level to get to. That's my message. Thank you, Lori. I really do like that. I like where that went.
Maybe that's the kind of church I'll have when I'm 65. It'll be the church of you pick the sermon. I like that. Maybe we'll pass the bucket around. Instead of telling people to put money in the bucket, we'll tell people to put their thoughts and ideas in the bucket. And we won't worry about taking money during a service. We'll worry about talking to each other. Let the money come on its own afterwards behind the scene. God will take care of all that. I believe that. I really do believe that. Okay. Thank Let's you. reinvent the wheel. That wheel would no, be. I don't think it's reinvent the wheel. I think it's, you know, I think about the wheel, and you remember back, you know, they said back in the day when they didn't have wheels, they used to carry stuff, but they, had, they knew what a circle was. Why didn't anybody ever look at a circle and go, hmm, I wonder if that would roll? So they did. All right. So, anyways, can't wait to hear your message. Mm. It's not going to be about strong, and it's not going to be about no health. It's not going to be about no wealth. Why are you looking at me like that? Yeah, I'm just trying to be stealthy. <laughs> no, that, that's not, my bro, you don't have to look at me like that, man. My dog does that at times. Because you know why? The dog's just looking at you going, man, if I just listen to you, no, I'm not going to learn a lot. No, and you no, might throw a bone my no, way. The dog's probably like, <laughs> Come pet me. Are, are you gonna take me out? Can I get a treat? Treat, treat, treat. And the tail start going. I'm like that ain't. So this, there's your message. Talk about motivation. Okay. What motivates a dog? Oh and what gosh. do we need to That's motivate not a person? What I want to talk about. Um, okay, talk about what you want to talk about. I want to talk about that. However, there are some different things that do that does motivate me. Like I will say that. Like what? Like. Cheech, <laughs> you're in here. Hey, Cheech, what's up, man? Steve, you did it again, right there. What, Cheech? What? No, you did it right there. I felt like a friend walked in the room. You said, hello, what's up? I thought I'd greet you. There's, there's, there's a moment for that. Let's talk. Let's get, no, no, you go ahead. I want you to talk now. Go ahead. Did you notice during your message, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't. I thought you was getting better, man. You didn't have a message yet. I'm like, no, no, no. During your message, right. I was going into my message. I didn't hear it. But you did Keywords, I started going into it. What were the keywords that let me knew you were going no, into no, the message? It, 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 it means you should listen. Okay. If no, you're you right. When you see you interrupt me, I was listening to you. I, and I remember, I was listening to you, and you said, Why are you, what are you doing looking at me? I was listening. No, no. That was said, active listening. No, no, no. I'm going to do then, it again. Watch this. I'm going to listen then, then. No, no, I'm done. I'm done. I'm cool. I got my message out. I'm good. They didn't get your message. No, yeah, because you interrupted me. All right. Don't, because you saw don't channel. Well, it's okay, Chief. I'm glad you're in here. You could have very easily waited. You're telling Cheech to have waited to come or, watch or the show? Or you could have Cheech, said, don't wait. Catch or us Or you could have said this. What? Hey, Cheech. Instead of... Because oh. that's what you do all the half the time, man. You just disrupt. You're a disruptor professionally. Don't cry. Is that what you do to your grandson? You make him cry? Talk good out here in these streets, yo. No, I want some breakfast. Well, Can I talk about breakfast? No, nope. I'm gonna talk about some life <laughs> hacks. Life hacks, life hacks. I try. I try. Never trust, never trust products that say they are clinically proven. That is a marketing term and means they have done their own private studies. <laughs> Whereas, scientifically proven means the study has been published and is open to peer reviews. So you get cl clinically proven and scientifically proven. So one, the studies has been done just by you or the product, where the other one has been done by that and is open for review. Yeah, man. Wow, that's crazy. That's like a, uh, it's like a trick. I did it. You know how frustrating you would have gotten if I tried to interrupt in any of all of that, and I kept my mouth shut the whole time. Oh, you want a cookie? Yep. No, I'm just right proud of myself. Which mic is mine? Hello. The same the wireless. Okay. What else is going on, man? No, no. Our co-host is missing in action. We, uh, we uh, promoted him from Wednesday's co-host to co-host to just co-host. So we now know we can expect to see him less. It's like, I, I get it, I think. I don't know. Some do, some don't. 
We upgraded him for him not to be upgraded. Yeah, it's but he's still upgraded. I, I, I just can't talk. <laughs> Some things are, you know, um, what's going on, new Subarus? Tell me what's on the corner out here right now. Right out here on the corner, you can come see it. On that. It's plenty of new Subarus. We got the um, the wilderness. I just said, tell me about one that you know about. Wilderness. What about? There's one sitting out here. It's a wilderness. Tell them about it. Some people don't know what you're doing. I talking. was going into it, but then you said tell them about it. I was doing that. It's called a wilderness outback. There are different trim levels on the outback. You got your base model, you got your premium model, you have your onyx, you have your limited, and you have your touring, but now there is what they call a wilderness. Instead of your 8.7 inches of ground clearance, you now have 9.5 inches of ground clearance. More rugged look, nice off-road tires, and a great suspension. I love a rugged Built look. Built from the factory for you, the people, to be able to enjoy your outdoors adventures. I like that. And also, don't forget about Shake Jinx. Oh, oh, wait, the paper was upside down. Uh, the Ascent Onyx Edition. Tell me about that, because you know your stuff. This guy knows his data. This is the one thing I like about the wilderness and the new Onyx. They blacked out things. And it, like you go in the wilderness inside, the ceiling is black versus being gray. I was like, I want the black ceiling. He Who did, I saw him do that too. He was like, what? That's all good. Yeah. And then in the Onyx Ascent, it is blacked out. There's no chrome around the, uh, the windows. Normally it's chrome, it's no chrome. It looks good. And then inside, normally where there's ivory, for those who know about the scent, there's no ivory. It looks real good. It's like a carbon fiber finish. Indeed. Hey, listen, last Saturday, we had Super Subaru Saturday here. A lot of fun. Catch the video on our website, SubaruSub.com. It's at the top of the page. You don't have to go all the way down. It's been refreshed. Uh, YouTube viewers, we're still looking for you. We're reigniting everything. We're pushing the steam, we're pushing the gas pedal down. We're on that long road back, but we're coming back. So we're on the road. Join us, stay with us. I may or not have changed headliners before. Okay, Chief. And Super Chief Speechless? No, Roy, I'm trying to practice active listening, which is a very, it's a challenge for me. Uh, let's see, what else is going on? Anything else? Um, we're just waiting for you to get better. Yeah. Outbacks? I'm better now. I got Outbacks to sell. Yeah, I mean, you want to get rid of your Outbacks. Like, you have a collector's item. Uh, it's not about that. Don't you? Yeah, that's it. Yeah, yeah, those of you my age, you want to talk about yeah. how our priorities no, and stop. mindsets completely stop. change the order we you, get? You, your name is Subaru Steve, and you don't want to be a Subaru Steve anymore. You are. Why would you even change your name so and make your name Subaru Steve beautiful. if you don't want to, you know, take advantage of it? No, we're not gonna do this. Look, y'all. It shall be an amazing day, an amazing so weekend. Beautiful. It's what the twenty-fifth of the month. Whale song. <laughs> Different world. Sorry, that sounds like a whale talking. I knew a whale, a, a beluga whale. Sounds like a whale talking. That sounds like a whale. No, no that no. was a whale I knew. No. Oh yeah, he's here. No. He's no. saying, what's up, Subaru Steve? That's not a whale. That's a whale. It's not a whale. Sounds just like a beluga sperm whale. No, it doesn't. Yep. I promise you. How do you know? How do you know that wasn't a whale laid into the soundtrack? That's a whale. That's just not a whale. Oh, man. Hear it? Oh. Oh. Trying to do the Elaine dance? I love that. That was so funny. Everybody's wondering what's going on here. Oh, that's, that's, a that's a whale. That sounds nothing like a whale. That sounds. What was his name? Falapu. Falapu, the beluga sperm whale. That's him. All right, y'all. That's Make him. Make sure you finish your day 25 and 0. Remember, you run the day or does the day run you?